Wow. This is the gold standard of restoration. This 1969 Camaro RSSS L78 is loaded with options, has 31 miles on a nut and bolt, correct, pristine factory restoration. Down to the assembly line markings. Uh, I got so much to tell you about this car. The list of options is crazy. I mentioned L78, that's a 375 horsepower motor. We got a houndstooth deluxe interior, console, gauges, Tilt Rosewood wheel, spoiler, stripes, the exterior package, power steering, power disc brakes, posi rear end. The list goes on and on and on. This car, this is it, man. If you go go back to 1969 and order a brand new Camaro, I don't know if you could do much better than ordering this right here. Go to volocars.com. That's where you can read all the information. Take your time and look at over 100 photos, top to bottom. And that is where you'll find the price tag along with the monthly finance option on every car that we have for sale. With only 10% down, our banks will go 12, 13 years on most of our cars. That's at volocars.com. If you enjoy these videos, subscribe to our YouTube channel, click on the bell icon, and you'll be notified when the new ones are posted. For right now, join me. Let's go for a spin. Yeah, this car is amazing. I mean, we get nicely restored cars, or you get cars where a guy, you know, says everything's new on it, but nothing fits right, nothing came together. This thing is new, it's fresh, it's detailed. Uh, from what I've seen so far, there's nothing to apologize for, but we are going to look at it together up close. So, it's a subframe, so it's frame off restored, but every component was removed from the bottom of this car, everything. So it was just a, a bare shell on a rotisserie, and then everything was restored or replaced or rebuilt to factory specs. So there's no Q1, QA1 shocks or anything like that. All the suspension, steering, ball joints, springs, all replaced. They put the assembly line markings back on the suspension. The steering is all replaced. The brake system's completely restored to factory. Uh, all the e-brake cables, all the brake lines, the hoses, all replaced. All new discs in front. The correct style exhaust is two exhaust pipes going to one transverse muffler and then back to two pipes. That's all new and correct. Fuel systems all new, the tank, the lines, all of it. You look up at the motor, it's spotless, uh, Chevy orange, all stock oil pan, starter, fuel pump, and all looks new. It has the Muncie four-speed transmission. The VIN number of the car is stamped on the trans. The dates and codes line up, October, that's the date of the car. 12-volt uh, posi rear end. The floors are pristine metal, smooth, clean metal, all painted like a satin black. It is detailed under this car. It looks like it was just done uh, last night. It's that fresh, only has 31 miles on it. Now let's look at the body. Absolutely straight, fits beautifully, fantastic. Absolutely straight, lines up just right. All of this clean, all metal, no rust, no damage. I don't see any funny business. I don't see any weird body work or anything like that. Door opens and shuts real nice. Yeah, this is all outstanding. The line's nice and crisp. All of this is excellent. I'm looking at the body, and it is, it's pristine. I don't, I don't see anything to complain about at all. It's repainted Garnet Red, which is 52 on the tag, no vinyl top, so it's all red. And the paint, I'm going to say, is better than it would have been from the factory in 1969. It is polished smooth like glass. And again, no funny areas, no shrinkage, no cracking, no chipping. All the paint is amazing. It's gorgeous paint. I'm going to be really honest with you. This cowl, they ended up, they did have to repaint. They scratched it when they were putting the wipers on. It's a shade different. That's the only flaw that I can find to tell you about in the paint. Now, I'm going to tell you about another cool uh, thing that maybe some of you know, some don't. The hockey stick stripes, they are done exactly correct. 
Why the factory did this, I don't know, and a lot of people don't know this, but this was painted on at the factory. This is a decal. Why they broke it up, I don't know. This one's done correctly. It's the first one I've seen, and I can't remember how long. They're usually either all decal or all painted. This one's done correct. The trim. Every piece of trim, the stainless, the correct antenna, the ice cube trays. Uh, it has the exterior trim package. That's the louvers, the wheel moldings, and the gutter trim. But all of it is new, and it all fits right. It's not loose or... You know, the corner's not popped out. All of it is nice. It's a big block car, so the tail panel is painted black. It has the optional bumper guards. It's a rally sport, which includes the reverse lights down here instead of right here. And again, everything is slick, shiny, sparkling. The glass is all new. The back window, the side glass, windshield, all new. The window seals, the fuzzy strips are new. All the weather strips are new. You might notice it's sitting on 14-inch rally wheels. They look brand new. The trim is sparkling. And reproduction Goodyear polyglass tires at all four corners. It has front and rear spoilers. I'll demonstrate the headlights at the end of the video when we back it out. They open and close uh, real nicely. So this car on the exterior is better than when it rolled off the assembly line. Let's see how the inside is. Let's see how the trunk looks. I bet you it looks brand new like the rest of the car. Yes, it does. Bottom of the trunk lid is slick as can be. Reproduction decals. The jam is slick. The weather strip is new. All the metal in here is completely clean with a nice spatter finish paint. We got the mat, we got the spare with the tire cover, restored jack assembly. I can see the insulation on the back of the seat is new. Uh, the wiring harness looks new. It's, it's like brand new in here, it's, and it's complete. This car sits right, feels right. Door jams are slick, the latches are new, all the rubber's new, and they fit right. Uh, sill plates are shiny. Now it's a deluxe interior, which includes that molded door panel, all new, new window cranks, little buttons uh, to turn on. The interior lights are new. All of this is new. The knobs, the trim, the the vents. Uh, 31 miles since it's been restored. New dash pad that fits right. It's got a tachometer. The heater control panel is all new, original AM radio, ashtray, matching cigarette lighter, all this stuff is new. Got some literature, the light works, kick panels, the levers for the vents, all new. The carpet has the console with the stacked gauges, Hurst 4 speed. The reproduction seat belts, they haven't even been removed from the plastic yet. Cushions, seats are all rebuilt. The cushions, the white deluxe houndstooth upholstery, um, headrests, backs of the seat, the knobs, the latches for the seats. Of course, everything in back also. The seat, the rear shelf area, the side panels, the window cranks, headliner, visors, dome light, the mirror, all new, and it all fits right. And then we got to talk about the Rosewood Deluxe wheels on a tilt column. I'm um, even looking up under the dash and the wiring and pedals and everything looks new. It just gets better and better. It's a correct 1969 396 L78 motor. The VIN number is stamped on the front of the block that matches the car. Uh, so this is solid. Well, they came solid lifters. A lot of people convert them to hydraulic lifters, um, but does have the factory aluminum intake as the big square port heads. 
uh, proper fuel line and the open element air cleaner, valve covers, GM hose, uh, date coated spark plug wires, distributor, everything looks brand new and it's not even dirty, it's not even road grime. It's got a big block heater core, GM hoses and clamps, a Delco battery topper with the spring clamp cables, the right radiator cap. All the brackets and pulleys and everything, the fan, the shroud, the horns. This is all for the headlight system. It's all vacuum, opens and closes them. The little flaps are stapled in here. It has the little uh, retainers that hold the bolts from uh, working the uh, way out. Power steering, power brakes, new wiper motor. Got the stamps on the firewall. It's got hood insulation. This, again, this is the gold standard here. This is, this is top-notch stuff. This car sounds exactly like it should sound. That's what the L78 sounds like, the idle. It has a distinct sound. This one's got it. All right, this car is as good as it gets. If you're that fussy type, you want the best of the best and nothing uh, less than that will do, this is it right here. Again, colors, options, features, uh, quality is off the charts. Go to volocars.com. The salesman can help answer your questions. They can help get it financed. They can help get it to, to your door uh, at volocars.com. If you enjoy the video, remember to subscribe, click on the bell icon. We've been adding two, three videos a day. Thanks for watching.